Don't make me hurt you. You're my best son, my favorite son. Not even you you can handle this forever. It's a classical Greek story with a new twist. Heracles, no, don't! I usually start to take on the energy of the character, and I just sort of have to keep that on all the time. Feel it? That was amazing! It's allegorical, it's spiritual, it's, um, it's supposed to be very meaningful. If Zeus had sent a man or a woman, it would have been the same result. If, if Prometheus had sent a man or a woman with his visions, it would have been the same result. The work on the rock is what matters. If I wasn't sent to save Prometheus, why was I sent? All throughout the play, she's overcome these terrible trials, and she's she been through all these terrible things to free Prometheus. And then she sort of like gets there, and she feels like it was all for nothing. You were not sent to save, but be saved. It was like emotionally intense in sort of a different way, I think. Artemis, your brother Apollo sends liquid fire to enliven your body. It's kind of cool, it's just like normal acting work plus like the normal character development and character research along with, okay, let's cool. figure out your physical body and how it's different. Oh, wow. And there's that little monkey that's like, Whoa. One thing I've taken from the script is that Prometheus Unbound is definitely a story of a journey for each character has their own journey that they go through and then while we're on the journey we're discovering things, we're learning things, we're discovering things about ourselves and about each other, we're discovering things we never knew before, so that's of course a great metaphor for life and it's um, something that everyone in the audience can relate to.